William McGill. Have a good evening. Thank you very much. This year, the Institute itself is celebrating its 125th anniversary. One of my main aims during my presidential year is to inspire as many of our young people as possible to look at the opportunities available to them in marine engineering, science and technology. For his dedicated and outstanding service to the Institute, it's my pleasure to present this President's Commendation Award to Dr. John McGrath. All I can say is thank you very much. That was a total surprise. And of course, I wish the Institute continuing success in the forthcoming years. Thank you all very much indeed. So we take spoon, fork and knife, thankful for the gifts of life. May there be much fun and laughter. For now, enough. I'll see you after. I'm honored to be asked to speak to such a load of eminent people as your good selves. We would do the first ever human journey around Earth vertically through both poles, never flying one meter of the 52,000 mile journey. We eventually, in a very bad way, made it to the North Pole where we put a flag. But it's pretty stupid because within one hour that flag will be a mile away from the pole because the ice is floating. I took the photograph of that crevasse because I could actually see it. Normally you can't until you've trodden on them, so I developed a careful policy which is to watch the bloke ahead. <laughs> Altogether, the expeditions have so far raised £16.3 million pounds for UK charities. Every expedition has a charity and a science programme. And the one thing I have learnt is that to get sponsorship, you need to remain ahead of your known rivals at all times. Thank you very much. I'd just like to finally say thank you very much indeed, everybody, for joining us, and I hope you had a truly wonderful evening. Thank you.